I do a lot of springboards, uh, Twitter stuff, and then I have my own Twitter account. Um, Laura does her Twitter, and she has her own Twitter account. Um, same thing with Nikki, same thing with Callie, and Betsy, mostly on Betsy's side. But um, I've noticed, and I feel like this is, has a lot to do with executive directors. I don't know why this is, but um, where they are the Twitter voice for their organization, and they also have their own account, um, and I, you follow both of them, and they use TweetDeck or Hootsuite or something with multiple account logins, and they basically check both boxes and send the tweet, and so in your Twitter feed, you get the same message from two people at once. Um, if they have a lot to say and they send three tweets in a row, then you know you only need half of those, and it just it it's not being considerate of your readers, I think, and um, it also, I don't know, maybe I feel it just looks lazy or something, you know, and and to be perfectly honest, to go back to the informational support click. Um, what Springboard does do is I will tweet something from Springboard and then I will schedule a retweet from myself at the exact same time with a comment from Noah to happen 15 minutes later. So what, the way I can do that is basically you do the same message, but one is my personal commentary on my organizational's message that I set later because in 15 minutes if you're following any amount of, of people um, your original organizational message is going to be bumped way down they may not see it and even if they do see it then I've commented on it and added something to that message to encourage a new audience or a new take on it and so that's the way I actually simultaneously tweet the same message but stagger it um, to get away from that because otherwise you're sort of wasting that um, mental space by putting the same message right next to each other. So don't double tweet. <laughs>